just want to come in here. This is part is a little disorienting because you can't really see yourself that well. But then there's this room. Um. Yeah, you just shoot the windows to get out of. You can shoot the top windows, but I'm not going to do that because it's actually sort of hard to shoot the top windows. You can also shoot these middle windows here as well. Obviously, as you know, the uh, things with the blue around them need to be forced, so I can't demonstrate that at the moment. I'm stuck. I'm just going to shoot all these windows out. Shoot them randomly. Explosions everywhere. Explosions of such. Okay. Kill all these battle droids. Die. So we're not going to go to that area yet. There is a secret area. Well, not exactly a secret. Just a bonus area down here. Nothing in here. Nothing in there, sorry. Screwing up my words again for some re random reason. I just I just screwed up the word random. I was about to anyway. So down here are a few battle droids. You can knock it over to that side without an astromic droid. But there are a couple of battle droids around here. You're going to want to come around here for a mini kit. So we got two mini kits out of ten. So we're going to go back up. Sorry about that. That was odd. See, this is why I need to get a screen recorder. I don't know. What the heck? I don't know. If, I don't know if there's a TV recorder or something, but I don't know. These can't be shot. No, they cannot. So in order to get through there, you just have to shoot the target fairly easy. It basically aims for you. When you hear the, uh, once you get the, to this area, you have found the Jedi. So you want to shoot that. Go around and collect the stud, and then fall down there, collect the blue stud. There'll be a whole bunch of battle droids, but you can be the Jedi now, so you can get a power up that's right there. Kill all the battle droids. So yeah, you get the two Jedi now. Obi Wan and uh, Qui Wan. I nearly said. I nearly said Obi Wan and Anakin. But I believe you can actually go back to the actual, actually first area and force stuff. Ah. Oh. Yeah, yeah. So I think there may be a couple of other mini kits you can get with it. So I'm just gonna destroy all these flowers. Turn off my lightsaber, because I don't need it at the moment. Well, I will for this, but... So I'm gonna destroy that. Uh, sorry if you couldn't hear what I was saying. I just need to shoot all three of these targets. Why is it making that music? Oh, it's only two targets, okay. Turn to any Jedi. I won't quite on that. And when you jump here, and land on that button, it'll bring you back up. So I believe you can get back to the other points to get some more mini kits, actually. No, you cannot. I was mistaken. You cannot leave the area if there are Jedis. Or Jedi. Sorry. Um. You just get replaced by the gun people. Smart feature, Lego. Smart. Smart. Okay, so there's a whole pack of battle droids here. We're not going to fight yet. So there's a secret area up here, sort of. You need a gun guy. That's what I like calling people with guns that can grapple. And the gen heat heater just turned on again. So I'm going to turn it up again. Press Z. Go up here. You need a small person for that. We'll get into small people soon enough. You want to grapple over here? It's a different type of grapple. Destroy the battle droids. Stay away from me, Queen and Amadala. I don't feel like you right now. Oh, apparently you can't shoot these. I think you need to be a Jedi. I changed into Qui Gon. I don't want to be um, Obi Wan for some reason. There are a whole bunch of studs here. Oh yeah, one other thing I may refer to these studs as is, um, coins. No, I didn't use them. So there are these bushes here that you can force. And fight off a whole packet of battle droids. I nearly called it a package. I didn't think battle droids came in packages, although in the final level of this episode, you may see that they come in, you may, you will see that they come in boxes. Yeah, you will see that. They come in boxes. Interesting. They're not like presents or anything, so why do they come in boxes? Okay, I'm so gonna stop ranting on. So you get a power-up. Oh yeah, power-ups also let you force things faster. 
I'm discovering some more stuff about power-ups as I go along because, as I said before, I haven't played this in a long while. I should not, I should have forced that first. Okay. So, nearly got two Jedi. I'm gonna kill you. Hopefully kill you in time. Destroy you, destroy you. Now that thing, when you destroy the things on top of those, they will start going up and down. You need a gun guy. Not to be confused with a Gungan. Uh, to get up there. Speaking of Gungans, where's Jar Jar Binks? Where'd he get off to? I actually have no idea. Where did Jar Jar Binks go? <laughs> interesting. Very interesting. Okay, not really. We've nearly got two Jedi here, and the uh, level is nearly done. So I'm gonna collect all these studs, or rather we are, if you're following, to what I'm doing. So I'm going to change to Captain Panaka. So you need to shoot both of the targets. Sometimes a little hard, you gotta get the timing correct. Wait for that to come down again. What the heck, it wasn't shooting. Eh. Oh yeah, and there's an area up there. Up there. But you need a, uh... I'm gonna call them jumpers from now on, I guess. Someone that can high jump. Um, or jump high. So, a jumper. You need a jumper to get up there. So, we'll have to do that in free play. But, for the time being, let's collect more of these studs. We're just about at True Jedi. So that's nice. Yep, True Jedi. Okay, so... There are some more battle droids just around here. This is... There is a lot to do, to do in this area. And I mean a lot. Like, there are all these things to force and everything. Tons of battle droids. A couple of mechanisms, I guess you can call them. Lots of stuff. Lots. So force that. Jump over here. Collect the studs. As the battle droids attack, I accidentally um, close my lightsaber. Attack. 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 Stupid battle droid. Force death. Okay, so we're going to come over to this area. Destroy these things. Okay. So, we're going to collect the stuff from here. These things over here. There are three of them on this side and three on the other side. So, you can open them by activating these these mechanisms. They're sort of mechanisms, I guess. I'm going to force that. Oh, it didn't force long enough. I think you have to force those a little too long. In my opinion. Click that. Okay. Destroy that. This part is probably boring at the moment, but don't worry, we'll get into some more teaching stuff soon, I guess. So, there are buttons on these. There are three of them. There are buttons, as I just said. Okay, so... We do this. Collect the studs. I'm probably agonizing you right now, because you're wondering what these do. So if you step on it, it'll show you what things they open. So it opens that. And I think that's about it. I think it also opens another thing on the other side, maybe. When you destroy that, it has a stud in the center, a blue one. Or at least it spits out a blue stud. So when we get to the other side, we'll see if it opened up anything. Or we can see from here. There's some more battle birds right there. I think... Yeah, it did. And as you may have seen, there's a mini kit up there. I don't know if it is possible in the story. We can see in a moment. So, we come around. around. We don't necessarily want... Wait, we do want to destroy the trees. But we don't want to... We can't destroy the bottom. We need them to be forced. Wait, no, after I press the button. After I press the button. So, yeah, the, the uh, holders for the trees, they can be forced, and they can help you get the mini kit. I think you can get the mini kit. So if you press that, that opens, which is our exit of the level. And I think possibly something else over here opens. I think. Yeah. But this can only be forced open with uh, Sith. Because it has red around it. So we're going to force that. 
onto there, which will help it get get higher. I think you need four to get onto it. But uh, Jedi can't jump that high. I think they can only jump up to three. So we're gonna need uh, some player switching, sort of, I guess, uh, to help with that. So if we get this four side up there. Oh no, it went off the screen. It went off the screen, so I couldn't force it any longer. Uh, yeah. If, you, if the item you're forcing goes off the screen, you won't be able to force it anymore. So I think what I have to do here, is I think I have to jump up here. I have to... Maybe I have to, uh... Maybe I can jump up to this high. I don't think I can. Yeah, I... I wait, oh, I can. And if, uh, you... Double jump and then you uh, do that attack, you'll be able to get it. So there are a whole whack of battle droids there. As in a few. Um, wait until you see this a level in the Clone Wars. That is a whole whack. Um, but so I'm going to press this in the midst of the battle. And that one will open up, which is silver, which means you have to have a bomb. As I explained earlier. And I think the last one over here should have opened up. It may possibly give a mini kit, does it? No, just give these ones over here just give us blue coins. Hey, you get away from me. Oh, peaceful music, and you're still a battle droid. It's wonderful. Okay. So as the subsidies. Coming to a close in a sec. I'm gonna kill this one battle droid fancily. Fancily isn't even a word, is it? Hey! Oh no, I destroyed it before I forced it. Eh, who cares? That's the guy. Aww, this poor little queen Amidala, or the fake one at least, getting her. Ah yes, on the edge here there's a blue coin. Careful not to jump over. You can do that, I'm pretty sure. I'm not gonna demonstrate it, because I don't want to lose anything. That we have collected. Do you want the most as possible to unlock new characters sooner and uh, all that. So we're going to. Okay, that force one. Oh, I just, just destroyed that too. Ah, who cares? So this metal one has the mini kit. This just has the uh, the blue stud. Sorry, I, I'm hiccuping. Therefore, um, explaining my lack of words at the moment. Uh, but so it's up to this bit to end, more like the second part of this episode, because this level has lasted a while, so, yeah, this will be part two, if you want to destroy that, and jump in, and, uh, there you go, you completed the level, so it's just the battle droid doing randomness, roger, roger. and then they fall on top of them. Yep, so as I said, this is probably going to be part two. Um, so yeah, apparently that's a shiny ship. Doesn't look too shiny right now, it just looks more like gray. So, I've got the level complete. We've unlocked Queen Amadella and Captain Panaka. Honestly, the new LEGO version of them from 2011 looks way better. Uh, but so, we got two Jedi. Got a whole bunch of studs. Sorry, I skipped the uh, stud total by accident. Got three out of ten mini kits. Got two more gold parts. Yeah, two more. We're gonna head to the Moss Island Cantina, and as normal, after a level ends, and with destroying something or killing someone, or at least attacking someone. Okay, guys. So uh, Mergman Four, over and out, and uh, see you guys later. No! <laughs>